I'm Linda Featherstone. And I'm Scoop Stevens. Welcome to Sports Desk. Early reports of wall sightings were initially dismissed as bogus and apocryphal. These wallies, believers of the wall, were thought to be crazy, but it now appears that they may have been prophetic. We go live to Danger Dan for the story. Dan, what's going on out there? Thanks, Linda. I'm standing here in front of one of these strange walls that seem to be popping up all over UBC campus. The question is, are they a hoax? And what do the cryptic words on the wall actually mean? When I approached the UBC Rec staff volunteer, they denied to comment and said, don't worry about it. All of us remember Storm in the Wall of 2011, when Super Iron Man Andrew White defeated the Great Wall of UBC. Will the event be happening again this year? And who will defeat the wall? That are the questions that we here at Sports Desk would like to answer. Back to you, Scoop. Thanks, Dan. UBC is currently recruiting members for its Stormtrooper campaign in an effort to ward off the evil 12-foot walls. Recruitment ends March 21st, with rumors of an epic showdown March 25th to 29th. Is there any truth to these rumors? Will these efforts be in vain? Only time will tell, but we here at Sports Desk are dedicated to you bringing you all the sports news as it unfolds. Thanks, Scoop. Remember that tri -Do is happening this Sunday on the UBC campus. Registration is still open until Thursday, March 8th. Hundreds of triathletes are getting ready for the race of a lifetime. Come by, say hi to rec volunteers, and cheer on the athletes. Should give Titan bright parties a run for their money. That's all for us here at Sports Desk. Have a happy and healthy week, you.